Hey, Crossbridge. Hey, Crossbridge. Hey, Crossbridge, good to see you. Let me be filled with kindness and compassion for the one. The one for you. Change is, is sometimes needed, and change can oftentimes be good. Every one of us is, is replaceable. Now, that, that's terrible news. I know, it's kind of depressing. The truth is, there'll come a day when I'm not the pastor of Crossbridge. Someone will come, and this mission will go on. I'm not giving this dog away, right? This is my dog. They would see you Even in just a smile They would feel the Father's love was, was this for someone? And so I thought I would just try it today And um, I'm sad to say I, I just can't do it In fact, um, all of us have breaking points, right? Um, in fact, uh, that felt awful, if I'm just honest felt absolutely awful and I just like to remain neutral if that's possible just neutral hey have a good week um, and I look forward to seeing you online thank you so much uh, peace out I think I was having to cut it after thank you so much <laughs> here's the deal we are a weird family this church is different you, you follow me? Well, I'm just teasing. I'm just joking. Just joking. Kind of. Even in just a smile, they would feel the Father's love. Uh, when I think about, right, like, what do I want to say? What do I want to, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, you're okay. Uh, I mean, that, you know, when the phones go off, I'm always like, man, Jesus is calling, right? He's calling. Just say yes. Pick it up and say yes. We have to be the people who will say yes. We are family. And, uh, and I love Crossbridge. And I'm just so thankful to be your pastor. I care about you. I care about your family. I care about your marriage. I love when you, and you'll see it here in a little bit. When we pull people out of the water and the water just kind of comes over their face and their hair peels back, you know. I love it. This is my favorite thing to do as a pastor. Jesus finds a way to communicate to every person on an individual basis. And, and so often, over and over and over and over, what people do is they come to me and say, man, I feel like you're talking to me. This is what we do. When someone needs help, no matter what it is, even if it's nasty feet, we do it. Because this is who we are. When people walk through those doors for the very first time, it doesn't matter where you come from. It doesn't matter what you did yesterday and it doesn't matter what you did last month or the last 20 years of your life. That God has been pursuing, the one who created you has been pursuing a relationship with you. And what he says to you is, man, you may feel like you've done everything wrong, but it isn't about you. It's about how I feel about you. Believe in him. Your life is not yours. Turn to Jesus. Are you tracking with me?